Okay, you guys. So my hair is gigantic. I went to the pool today, so it is super like puffy. <laughs> that is extra puffy. That is extra extra puffy. Okay. Today I have my inspo box. I got the beauty box. It was an impulse buy. I emailed them, please cancel and refund me. They never replied. And I got a shipping notice the same day. So I think they chose to ignore it. I don't know. Oh, they're super fast shipping. That's a good thing. But I saw um I saw their like sneaks for the beauty box. Something squeaking in there. And I wanted to get the palette. And then I was talking to my sister and I'm like, why did I get it? I have a million palettes. I don't get it. I was impulsive. This is $29.99. I think it's free shipping or they might add a little bit of free shipping but it wasn't crazy and um it's usually they do you do get a really good deal they have a lifestyle inspo box deluxe lifestyle inspo in a beauty box so i'm gonna take everything out there's usually no product card everything's tossed in a mailer like not super like you know but they focus on i think bringing you more product for the price so you can post your inspo box on Instagram or Facebook and tag them to win one box for free. Okay, so let's start with the palette that I was tempted and it came wrapped super well in bubble wrap. So I appreciate that because this was the Anastasia Beverly Hills by Alyssa Edwards. I have no idea who that is, but look at this color. It's a hot pink. The palette is super pink. And the colors looked amazing. But then again, I'm like, do I probably have these colors? I don't know why I did that, you guys. I got very impulsive. Look at these colors. Ah, we have that yellow and pink and purples and some ochres, blues. I know. This is insane. Um, I'm not going to swatch it because I might put in a giveaway if I... I know. I bought it for myself and then I'm like, it comes with a nice... Um, I like the brush this side. This one is not crazy, but I feel like Anastasia is one of the brands that has a good um, good enough brush. Um, I'm going to see what I do, you guys. I don't know if I'll keep it. Again, I always like to see if I have these colors because I don't want to swatch a million and use like a million of palettes and then have 10 used palettes with similar colors, you know? So, But it does look amazing. And the names are like Headliner Inspired Unicorn Tribe. Brick Road, Texas Made, Dream It. So who is Alyssa Edwards? I should probably Google it. Okay, so Alyssa Edwards is actually Justin Dwayne Lee Johnson, known by the stage name of Alyssa Edwards, an American drag performer, choreographer, and business person. So yeah, I had no idea who it was, but I guess he's from Texas maybe. Um, yeah, so that's it's a beautiful palette and I love the colors and I love even the outside, it's gorgeous. So we'll see if I'm going to keep it or not. But it does look amazing. That was the main thing. I mean, this has a value of $45. So the box was $29.99. So that's pretty good. I don't know if the, you know, the palettes are like going on sale or something and how they can get them, but they're really good. Okay. But there's more and not less exciting because it's really good. We have this and this is <laughs> adorable blending spot uh, sponges and then there's a reusable cup and stroke i just got some blending sponges on amazon and i just love that it has a little tweed you can open it and this actually has a stainless steel straw and just really nice so not bad let me open this up and it has a ton of blending sponges which i bought on amazon for 8.99 like about like 10 but it's fine because i find that i they get lost this one's a cute pink marble. They feel good. Okay, then we have the one with the slanted tip. We have a uh, hot pink. We have two marbles, two hot pink, and two baby pink. So six. That's not bad. I mean, I love it. Love these. They're awesome. And I love that this is a reusable cup. It's, this is plastic, uh, but this is like metal and stainless steel. So that's nice. Nice for smoothies in the summer, you know, or juices and stuff like that. Super cute. Nice. That was a squeaky sound. Then we got some Zola lashes. And I love the cloudy um, box design. Premium 3D mink lashes. And this look right. This look nice. They look full and dramatic, but I feel like I can pull them off maybe. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. 
but nice to have i do have a lower low lashes because i subscribed to that 13.99 box wink lash bag or something and you know they came with a ton then we have an easy to operate uh, let's see okalan artistic diamond skinny no shiny liquid liner in gold 202 and oh look how pretty that is that's like a nice eyeliner i never wear gold eyeliner should i maybe it will be a nice thing let me swatch it oh that's nice it might actually be nice to wear so i swatched it already so it's not gonna go in a giveaway but it's okay okay next up we have a set of five by wonderless beauty five um brushes and i feel like wanderlust beauty and this company are the same company because sometimes they do ship from wanderlust beauty and i don't know they say that they have the same fulfillment center but i feel like they maybe actually are sister companies these brushes are really cool they look super fun they're like neon and i don't know if this is something no the handle is like half metal half plastic we have some pink ones they're all very fluffy. I like that. This one's more like a packer, but these ones are two. Okay, so two packers and two more blending brushes, which I like. Because that's what I wear them. Like, I use the most. So, really nice. And do we have anything else? Oh. Do we? Okay, one. Oh, yeah, we have two more things. Okay. We have Priming is Everything by The Balm Natural Eyeshadow Primer. Okay. Nice. Okay, I love The Balm. The packaging is so nice. <laughs> Priming is everything. Um, it has like a rainbow and then it's an eyeshadow primer, which I think I have, but not like this. And I'm, I'm excited to try this because I always forget to put primer, but it's nice. Love this color. And yeah, I actually don't think I have eyeshadow primer per se. I think I had and I don't know if I put them in a giveaway and then I regret it. <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. So I was like, I wasn't, I didn't mean to put that, but it's fine. Ooh, and then we have by LA Girl, a matte lipstick in I don't know if I had this lilac color or what, but I saw the preview and it showed like a nude color. So I didn't know if that was a concealer, like concealer, you know, lipstick, lipstick, a concealer stick <laughs> or what, or if it was a nude lipstick. But if I had this lilac, that would be nice because I don't have this color. Let's open it up and see. And it's matte. Ooh. <gasps> oh. It is, a, it is darker than what it shows here for sure, okay? It's darker. It's not the same color, which I don't always love because you're like, oh, I'm going to get this, but no. But this color looks amazing, and I don't think I have this. I have, like, dark purples. There's some kind of liquidy thing. I don't know if you can see that. See that liquidy thing there? The little oils. Okay, I'm going to swatch this. Oh, this looks gorgeous. I'm so excited. Let me see. I'm going to try to put it on. Mm, I love this color. And I done hot. I have darker purples. I don't know if it shows because I have something pinky, you know. So I'm going to have to build it up a little bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love it. I love it. Okay. This is a really good bag. This was a really, really good bag for $30. I think you get a ton of stuff in name brands. I think it's definitely a bag that I would recommend if you like beauty. I'm like all makeup. $29.99 plus shipping and shipping again it wasn't that much I think maybe five dollars we have an LA girl matte lipstick I love this color you're gonna see me wearing it in all my videos we have a gold eyeliner which is not usually my comfort zone but I think it does look really pretty we have some lashes we have an eyeshadow primer by the balm we have a set of five makeup brushes we have an Anastasia Beverly Hills and there was another one of the boxes, the beauty box and the regular inspo box had an Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. So super nice. And this is a gorgeous, gorgeous, um, gorgeous palette. And then we have a reusable cup. 
with six beauty blenders or makeup sponges so that was a really good box okay i think that this is a good box i don't love their customer service and i don't love their packaging because it just comes like this but um maybe again they're focusing on bringing you more products and more quality products and name brands and you know packaging is that they're saving cost on that um i think it would be nicer if they came in a box i think the info box let me know if you get the info the regular box i'm gonna check because i know robin used to get it if they do put put it in a box or not um but yeah this was the info box i'm probably gonna cancel as i need to save some money <laughs> And I think this is the only, except the Wink, the Wink bag, the Wink Lash one. And this one is the only two subscriptions that I have right now. But I really love the uh, palette and I was like, I was too tempted. But anyway, I don't know. Like, I might get tempted again. <laughs> oh, okay. Actually, the, um, I just remember the, the eyeshadow primer was a gift, an extra gift for subscribing. So then you get one, two, three, four, five, six items, and this was a gift. So check it, check it out because you might get it as well if you want to sign up for that. Um, let me know. I don't have a code, but I will ask them on Instagram to see if they want to give me a code to share with you guys or if they have an active code that is a general one so you guys can save some money. But you do, you might get this extra gift. So that's a nice thing, you guys. Um, this is a good box. I mean, again, it's not a super, I feel like they're not very personable like they're not out there in the community much they just you know promote their boxes and they deliver the product and they're very kind of like that just that you know they're not like again like they don't do a lot of interaction they don't respond emails very quick although when i emailed them before about my the bug the bag that i got and it came from wanderlust beauty they did reply but in a couple of days you know so they're not like amazing i think like maybe they have to work on that maybe it's a one woman show i'm not sure um but they do deliver amazing product. I think the products are really good. So let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much for joining me on another video. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, please give it a thumbs up. Watch the whole video if you can in other videos to help me out a little bit. And I will see you on my next one. Bye.